snowboarding exhibition at Birth of Pass. Tom, snowboarding, the sport, how do you feel about it right now? Well, the sport's come so far in the last three years that uh, it looks like it, there's no stopping it now. Uh, we struggled there for 15, 20 years to get even my friends going on it. And now since about 1976, it's been steadily growing. In the last three years, it's, uh, it's just gone wild. In the last two years, we've had so many ad uh, equipment advances that uh, the riders are able to handle more difficult terrain, handle slalom gates better. Mm -hmm. So the contests are getting better, the kids are getting better, and uh, more ski areas are opening up. So it's all up from here. OK, well, this event is going to precede the event in March, which is going to be the King of the Mountain Snowboarding Championships here at Birth of Pass again. And I guess Mark Christensen has to be one of the favorites for that competition. How do you feel about that, Mark? Uh, I feel like it's going to be a real hot, real hot contest in March. There's going to be better snow, a lot more snow and a lot more people out here knowing about it. It's going to be real hot. OK. Who do you feel is going to be one of the favorites for that competition? Uh, well, definitely Tom's in there, I think. OK. Tom, uh, uh, Dave Thiebel's an upcoming snowboarder. I know Matt, I don't know what his last name is. Matt Dodge. He's Matt Dodge. Strong. He was hot today. OK, well, those are some of the names that we're going to be looking for in March, March 18th, at Birth of Pass for the King of the Mountain Rocky Mountain Snowboarding Championships. And I'm Sandy Santusi for King of the Mountain Sports with Tom Sims and Mark Christensen. Thanks a lot, you guys, and uh, Viva Snowboards. All right. Yeah. All right.